So Rosie has kidney disease. Jerry is praying for her husband who has Parkinson's. The believers will lay hands on the sick and they shall be restored. They shall be healed. So in the name of Jesus, his kidneys will all free again. And anything that's in So this is me, Debbie, and Jerry today at Hello. the um, mall. And one of the questions we get is, how do you know when the Holy Spirit is asking you to go over to somebody? And mainly, we are attracted to them. Now, there's certain things that we don't do when we see someone is busy at a business with a customer. We don't do that. Or we don't, um, if they're on the phone, sometimes you do approach them if they're on the phone. Um, it is never a mistake to approach someone. Uh, even if they reject you, even if they say no thanks, uh, if they're very adamant about not being bothered, we say thank you, have a good day. It's not a waste that you approach them because they'll think back later and think, gee, see somebody, wonder what that was about. You know, that was kind of nice, that person uh, cared enough about me, asked if I needed prayer. But um, it's not as long as the Holy Spirit is leading another approach, and they immediately notice this sweet lady sitting here on the on the. Uh... So you ask, you know, how do we know how to approach people? Well, God attracts you to them. He draws you to the, to us. He draws us to them, and they are drawn to us because of Jesus that lives inside of us. So there is no accidental. Uh, meetings. So she's talking to this nice lady today. I'm not going to get too close. I don't want to be invasive. So she noticed, Debbie said she noticed the walker and she's asking to pray for her leg. I'm not going to keep it on too long because I don't want to be um, seeming like I'm in, uh, intruding. Woman seems very responsive, not uh, at all objecting. So they're going to pray. Wonderful. Jesus is the way Jesus is the 